I think just to kind of back up vampire sales, where that actually came from was watching people at networking events and really thinking of what it meant to be social before social media was a thing. What did it actually mean to be social? And so I, a lot of what my prospecting strategy was, was to go to local networking events because I sold a local, a product that I had to serve a local market. And I wasted so much time going to networking events and going nowhere. So I didn't, I was looking at my goals. I'm like, okay, so is this even worth doing anymore? And so I started doing a win-loss analysis and looking at what happened and a very big pattern jumped out. The only people that ever bought from me were the ones that asked me, so what do you do? Because I waited and I leaned in to be interesting and interested in them and ask questions and just be in the, be present in that conversation that when they did that flip, which is so critical, which most sellers miss is the flip where you go from the seller to the mm -hmm. advisor. It's an earned right to pitch. Yes. And so as soon as that flip happens, it opened the door to a deeper conversation where I could do discovery or I could have fun. That trust was now open and it went somewhere. They were willing to introduce me to people. There was referrals, but that flip never happened before. Therefore, it never went anywhere. And I think that's what happens a lot with people talking about, well, you know, LinkedIn's a waste of time. All I do is I talk. Yeah, you talk, but you're not proving that you're the senior advisor, that you're an asset to their team. You're just a vendor. And as long as you're just a vendor, you're just going to be pitching in the DMs. 